When it comes to our health, few things are as important as maintaining a healthy cardiovascular system. The heart, arteries, and blood vessels all play crucial roles in keeping our bodies functioning properly. However, there is a common issue that can jeopardize the health of our arteries, plaque buildup. Artery plaque, also known as atherosclerotic plaque, is a buildup of deposits on the inner walls of arteries. In this video, we will show you 10 foods that build artery plaque. Before we continue with the list, make sure to subscribe to Healthy Lab and turn on the notification bell so you won't miss any of our new videos. Every subscriber is much appreciated. So, let's start. 10. Ice Cream Eating ice cream is a delight many of us indulge in, particularly during the hot summer months. The creamy, sweet treat is a perfect way to beat the heat and satisfy our taste buds. However, it's important to be aware of the potential effects that consuming excessive amounts of ice cream can have on our health, particularly when it comes to our arteries. It all comes down to the ingredients found in ice cream, particularly the high levels of saturated fat and sugar. Saturated fat, which is abundant in many ice cream varieties, can raise the levels of LDL cholesterol in our bloodstream. LDL cholesterol is referred to as bad cholesterol because it contributes to the formation of plaque in the arteries. When we consume foods high in saturated fat, such as ice cream, our LDL cholesterol levels can increase, leading to the potential for plaque buildup over time. 9. Pasta One of the biggest concerns regarding pasta consumption is its role in building plaque in the arteries. Pasta is primarily made from refined wheat flour, which undergoes extensive processing to remove the bran and germ, leaving behind only the starchy endosperm. As a result, most of the essential nutrients, fiber, and antioxidants naturally found in whole grains are lost during this process. Refined pasta lacks the fiber content necessary for maintaining a healthy cardiovascular system. Fiber plays a crucial role in regulating cholesterol levels by helping to eliminate excess cholesterol from the body. By consuming refined pasta, which is low in fiber, we miss out on the opportunity to reduce our cholesterol levels naturally. Additionally, pasta is a high-carbohydrate food. While carbohydrates are an essential source of energy for our bodies, excessive consumption can lead to weight gain and obesity. Obesity is a significant risk factor for atherosclerosis and the development of plaque in the arteries. 8. Cookies The ingredients used to make cookies can have an unexpected effect on our health. Many cookies contain high levels of sugar, unhealthy fats, and refined carbohydrates, which can contribute to the formation of plaque in our arteries. When we consume cookies, our bodies break down the sugar and refined carbohydrates into glucose, causing a sudden increase in insulin production. Insulin is responsible for regulating blood sugar levels by allowing glucose to enter our cells for energy. However, excessive consumption of sugar and refined carbohydrates can overwhelm our body's ability to produce insulin, leading to a condition known as hyperinsulinemia. This condition causes the body to produce more insulin than necessary, which can stimulate the production of cholesterol and triglycerides in the liver. These lipids, combined with the remnants of sugar and refined carbohydrates, can then form plaque in our arteries. 7. Butter Butter, with its rich and creamy texture, has long been a staple in many people's diets. It adds flavor to dishes and is often used in baking and cooking. However, there has been ongoing debate about the health effects of consuming butter, particularly when it comes to its impact on the arteries. Butter is primarily made up of saturated fat, which is known to raise levels of LDL cholesterol in the bloodstream. When we consume foods high in saturated fat, such as butter, our body's cholesterol levels can become imbalanced. Excess LDL cholesterol can start to accumulate and oxidize in the walls of the arteries, triggering an inflammatory response. This inflammation, in turn, attracts immune cells to the site, which further promotes the formation of plaque. 6. High-Fat Cheese While cheese can be a delicious addition to our meals, its high-fat content can contribute to the development of plaque in the arteries. The primary reason behind this is the presence of saturated fats and high-fat cheese. Saturated fats are known to raise levels of low-density lipoprotein cholesterol, commonly referred to as bad cholesterol. Furthermore, high-fat cheese contains significant amounts of dietary cholesterol. While it is true that dietary cholesterol does not have as significant an impact on blood cholesterol levels as once thought, excessive intake can still contribute to the formation of plaque. Combined with the saturated fats, the dietary cholesterol and high-fat cheese can further exacerbate the buildup of plaque in the arteries. 5. Donuts. You may be wondering how something as innocent as a cookie can lead to plaque buildup in the arteries. Well, the answer lies in the ingredients that make up these delectable treats. 
Donuts are typically high in saturated and trans fats, which are considered unhealthy fats. These fats are often solid at room temperature and can raise our levels of LDL cholesterol. Additionally, donuts are often deep fried, which adds to their unhealthy nature. Deep frying involves submerging the dough in hot oil, resulting in the absorption of a significant amount of oil. This oil can be high in trans fats and can further contribute to the buildup of plaque in the arteries. 4. Eggs. Eggs have long been a staple in many diets around the world. Whether it's a delicious omelet for breakfast or a protein-packed addition to a salad, eggs are versatile and nutritious. However, there has been some controversy surrounding the consumption of eggs and its potential impact on our health, particularly when it comes to plaque development in the arteries. Eggs are known to be a significant source of dietary cholesterol. A single large egg contains approximately 186 mg of cholesterol, with the majority found in the yolk. This is why eggs have often been associated with an increased risk of heart disease and the development of plaque in the arteries. When we consume cholesterol-rich foods like eggs, the cholesterol is absorbed into our bloodstream and transported to different body parts. The liver, in turn, produces less cholesterol to compensate for the intake from the diet. Sometimes this regulation process doesn't work efficiently, leading to elevated cholesterol levels in the blood. 3. Alcohol. To understand how drinking alcohol contributes to the formation of arterial plaque, it is essential to delve into the intricate relationship between alcohol and our cardiovascular system. When we consume alcohol, it is rapidly absorbed into the bloodstream, where it begins to exert its effects. One of these effects is the increase in blood pressure. Elevated blood pressure, or hypertension, is a significant risk factor for the development of atherosclerosis, the condition in which plaque builds up in the arteries. Atherosclerosis occurs when the inner lining of the arteries becomes damaged or inflamed, leading to the accumulation of cholesterol, fatty deposits, and other cellular waste products. Over time, this buildup forms plaques that can narrow and harden the arteries, impeding blood flow to vital organs and tissues. 2. French fries. French fries are typically made from potatoes, which are high in starch. When these potatoes are fried in oil, they undergo a chemical process called acrylamide formation. This process leads to the creation of a compound known as acrylamide, which is linked to oxidative stress and inflammation in the body. Consuming foods that are high in acrylamide, such as French fries, can trigger an inflammatory response in our arteries. When our body detects the presence of foreign compounds like acrylamide, it releases inflammatory markers to protect itself. Over time, chronic inflammation can damage the inner lining of our arteries, making them more prone to the formation of plaque. Moreover, French fries are typically high in sodium. Excessive sodium intake can elevate blood pressure, leading to the hardening and narrowing of the arteries. When our blood pressure rises, it puts additional strain on the arterial walls, making them more susceptible to plaque formation. 1. Red meat. Eating red meat has long been a staple in many diets around the world. From juicy steaks to succulent burgers, it's no wonder why red meat is often a favorite choice for meat lovers. However, recent studies have shown that consuming excessive amounts of red meat can contribute to the buildup of plaque in the arteries, leading to potential health risks such as heart disease and stroke. One of the main culprits behind the formation of arterial plaque is the high content of saturated fats found in red meat. Unlike unsaturated fats, which are considered healthier options, saturated fats are known to raise cholesterol levels in the blood. When consumed in excess, these fats can contribute to the buildup of plaque in the arteries, as they are more likely to be deposited instead of being broken down and eliminated from the body. Furthermore, red meat is often cooked at high temperatures, leading to the formation of harmful compounds known as advanced glycation end products. These compounds are produced when proteins and fats react with sugars during cooking processes. Research has shown that advanced glycation end products can promote inflammation and oxidative stress in the body, both of which are key factors in the development of atherosclerosis. In conclusion, it is essential to prioritize the health of our cardiovascular system, as it plays a vital role in maintaining overall well-being. Artery plaque, or atherosclerotic plaque, poses a significant risk to our arteries and can disrupt their proper functioning. To prevent plaque buildup and maintain healthy arteries, it is crucial to adopt a lifestyle that includes regular exercise and a balanced diet. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in the next video.